A simple but powerful ceremony in Montechusa Regional Vocational Tech as staff and students took time to remember one of their own. The flags were lowered to half staff in honor of Lieutenant Ryan Jones of Westminster, who was killed in a roadside explosion Tuesday in Baghdad. Superintendent James Culkeen read Ryan's final letter sent to the school's ROTC members. It came on Monday, a day before he died, and it described his work and, ironically, how he was killed. The enemy's most dangerous weapon is the improvised explosive device, or IED. These are bombs that are placed on the side of the road and set to go off on innocent civilians or American convoys as they go by. Each day, my platoon and I patrol the streets of Baghdad looking for these IEDs. Once we find one, we either blow it up or disarm it. Never a dull moment. There have been a few times the IEDs have found us before we have found them. But don't worry, our trucks have enough armor on them to survive most blasts. Life isn't always great, but one of the things that keeps my soldiers and I going are the wonderful letters that you all sent. Hopefully, I will get a chance to visit the Junior ROTC program when I come back to my hometown of Westminster. Good luck to all of you. And if you decide to enlist in the military or join an ROTC program in college, it will be one of the hardest and most rewarding decisions you have ever made. Ryan was also a member of the National Honor Society, co-captain of the football team, well-liked by everyone, according to guidance counselor Jean DeRocher Mullins, who talked about what stood out most in her mind. His smile. <laughs> I know it sounds so simple, but he that's how I started off this college recommendation, was Ryan Patrick Jones makes me smile. Walk into the guidance office, Ryan, and he'd just be all smiles. The secretaries would look up and smile. He'd light up the office. Um, he was so personable, so kind, uh, service-oriented. Uh, and I don't mean military service necessarily, but worked in the um, Honor Society, National, uh, the Food Drive, the Toys for Tots. Um, he, he was just a terrific kid. Ryan graduated here in 2001 before going to Worcester Polytechnic Institute. His hometown of Westminster is also planning a ceremony. Montachusett is planning to create a scholarship for ROTC members in his name. In Fitchburg, Mark Caddick, WBZ News Radio, 1030.